An authority record is used in cataloging because it shows the preferred way to record titles, authors' names, subjects, and series. This can help a media specialist maintain consistency in the records that they have for items in their catalogs. A media specialist can choose to use a print copy of such an authority record, like the Sears Guide for Subject Headings, to refer to, or they can use uh, the district or the school library search function to pull up ways that terms were previously used in a record. Some systems allow you to search an authority record by clicking on a search icon while in Mark Editor, but in our case we must look through a, a written copy or use Destiny. So let's take a look at how we do that. First of all, um, let's type in a subject heading that we would like to search. Let's type in dogs. Here down below you see ways to make to do your search. Um, let's click on subject. Okay, now you have uh, over 400 titles relating to that search that involve the su subject heading dogs. Um, let's see if we can find out how our catalog has this subject listed in other ways. So what we do is we click on Browse Subjects. This uh, brings up lists of all the ways that dog or dogs are used in our catalog, you can see. And this allows us to use one of those subject headings when we um, are cataloging a new item to maintain consistency. Here you see you have a lot of titles that are simply under as dogs or dogs fiction. Um, these other subject headings are often the way that um, jobbers uh, subject headings are included in the records that they submit to us uh, for use in putting into our catalogs. So that is how you can um, use authority records to try to maintain consistency in subject headings in your catalog by cross-checking yourself or by looking at um, written uh, methods like the, the Sears Guide.